welcome back everybody we're exploring another memory scape uh, here in lost sphere as we learn more about Krom and the vorgs and emperor neodius oh we're back in the city the timeline is further into the future than before but i can't be sure well we've got smog and the lab is closed so kanada is not here you can tell lock yes and kanada is not here where is he? You're right to be worried, but not all hope is lost. We've not reached all the memories here. We should continue. And what makes you so sure? Did the Emperor not say that Kron's memories had control of Kanana's consciousness? What could that mean? No memory is infinite. It has a beginning and an end. We could call that end mind's end. I believe wherever Kanata's consciousness is, we'll find it at Mind's End. Let me know where to go and find Kanata. Mind's End. I believe so. What worries me is the almost certain war between the humans and Borgs that is to come. If we get caught up in the ensuing fight before we reach Mind's End, what then? Our minds will be trapped in the past never to return. The mindless flesh that exists in the real world will wither and perish. Thanks. Oh, bro. If you think I'm gonna let that happen, <laughs> never. Even if my mind is trapped here, my body will never die as long as it continues to function mechanically. <laughs> Thanks, Locke. You think the command will keep a gearoid that doesn't move forever? They'll toss it out on the trash heap the first chance they get is what they'll do. Rude. I would not like that. Leave him alone, Vaughn. It's not funny trying to get under Locke's skin like that. It's a little funny. In any case, we must be more careful now than ever before. We must avoid making risky moves. We'll be fine. It's, it's over. Hey, it's Ula. Hmm? Is that Ula? Oh, Lumina. And everyone else who never introduced themselves. Help, please help us. What happened? Be calm and tell us what happened. We need your help. I'm Morif. We are in so much trouble. I'm Tunks. The professor will be so disappointed in us. I'm Siebel. We need to do something about the Terramite. Uh-oh, Terramite. All of you slow down. Start from the beginning. We're so sorry. The professor asked us to come into town to procure some Terramite. Terramite isn't just something you can walk into town and buy. When will people learn? But to send you into a town overrun by Vorgs is reckless. Why don't you have an escort to protect you? We did, but they became lost a ways back. Oh, bummer. What do you want to do, Lumina? You can't just leave them out here. I'll escort them back to the laboratory. Hey, do I have to remind you what we're doing out here in the first place? We don't have time to be babysitting these guys. <sighs> but... But nothing. It's a bad call if you ask me. We cannot risk open conflict right now. If we keep out of sight of the Forks, we could avoid fighting for the most part. Thank you, Galdra. You're gonna have to do something while we're here, Vaughn. Now, what were you gonna get? Where were you gonna get your Terramite? From the merchant. Really? But where is this merchant? Hiding from danger somewhere in First City. The question is where? Yeah, easy. You don't have much to go on, do you? I told you this was a bad call. Hmm. What does everyone else think? Who cares? Let's just play the game. This may take some time. Remember, we don't want to engage in battle. We must use caution to keep ourselves out of the Borg site. Yes, I'm sorry. This way? So I don't even know if the merchant is this way. I'm gonna wait. It doesn't look like that way is gonna give me anything because that building's closed. Okay, 
that's not a merchant. Nope. Vaughn, can't you use bits like you did back in the prison block? There's too much area to cover. They might do too much damage. Might end up killing them. It's your call. Nope. there. Look at that person. Is that the merchant? Yeah, that's the merchant. It is. Well spotted. Praise our good fortune. The professor can continue his research. Yay, Krom. I'm Marie. I, I have a feeling that there's some kind of joke that I'm missing with these names. The professor's gonna be so happy. I'm Tongues. We can't thank you enough. Marie Tongues. You're gonna love this weapon we've been working on! Oh no. Thanks. Wonderful. I can't wait to see it. Uh, thank you, all of you. I know how loyal you are to Krom, but let me give you some advice. Don't trust him, or one of these days you're gonna regret it. You're wrong, sir. Nobody is more considerate and kind than the professor. He seeks to save us from the moon, and he asks nothing in return. And besides, Neodius never strays far from his side. He's always close by, isn't he? Yes, yeah, like powers. If the professor had malevolent, malevolent thoughts, Neodius would know. That's how we know the professor's motives are pure. Sounds to me like you're harboring your own thoughts for Professor Perfect. Aw, oh, snap, Vaughn! Don't be jelly, Vaughn. We return when a memory strand finishes. At least we were beginning to understand. Look, over there, a new eddy. Or a trap. Unlikely. Why would this one be a trap when all previous ones were safe? Obero has a point. Kanata awaits us on the other side. Unless we have no chance to save him, I will not give up. So you're saying there's a chance you'll give up, huh? Zing, I agree that we must continue. Kanata is out there. We must find him. Alright, uh, so a short episode, um, well, uh, I don't know why it went to this, but, here we go, um, uh, so a short episode, but we'll end this, and next time we will go into the next memory.
Uh, please like, comment, subscribe, and share this video. Until next time, Interceptor out.